You can't kill my confidence, I think I'm the man Tally all the f I ever gave on my head Lately I've been living like I can't take a loss They ain't wanna help me, that's what made me a boss you can't Check out this guy, bro Hey dude, forgot your trunk Let's go let him know, dude That's a nice car too. M series trunk open. Where's this Hogan driver? This fool just left this truck with his pumps in his uh, in his tank. That's what's up. Happy Monday, my friends. So I just got back in the peak at the end of this last at the end of this past week, and I'm still having issues with the with the hydraulics and the handles. So like the the issue that's happening right now. Whenever I start moving the handles, pretty much any any time I'm I'm putting it. I'm like raising the <clears throat> anytime I'm raising the ramps or uh, lowering the ramps what will happen is the the hydraulic lift the, the ramps will just keep moving by themselves that's obviously not good right because whenever I'm lowering them and I want them to stop by letting go of the handle what will happen is that ramp will just keep going down <laughs> so sometimes it'll go so close to the bottom cars the cars in the bottom and that's not good so I've been having this issue for like the past past month. Uh, our, my mechanics they keep on like doing something, like they'll they'll change out one of the valve one of the valve covers or something like that, um, and, they, and he'll think that that'll work, you know. But sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it, it does. So it's like uh, trouble. He's like they're like troubleshooting it, thinking that that's gonna work, and then. You know, I get back on the road, start loading and lifting the trailer, lifting the ramps up, and then that's when I start noticing problems again. It's really weird. It, it happens, you know, when I turn the PTO on and I raise the RPMs up so that the trailer lifts fast. And uh, my number two, when I lower that down, because I have to, I'll, I'll, I have a truck on my number one, right? And the the front, the front of my number one is is like a, a little bit overhead. It's on top. It's like sitting on top of my number two because I have to put my number two when I put a truck there. I have to put that all the way down so it's like uh number one on top so it's not they're not sitting uh back to uh, front to front uh to each other because it's not long enough on the number two so what happens is on my number two it'll raise up which is really weird i've never had that before so i don't know what do you guys think what do you what do you guys think that is that my uh my ramp on my number my number two ramp it raises up by itself when I have the PTO on. It already happened where I was loading and I didn't know that that thing moved and it moved up. It met the splash guard of the of the truck on the number one. Uh, luckily there wasn't any damage, but it, it touched it to that point where I was like, oh damn. So what I had to do was I put pins on both sides so that way it only went up so far. But man, that, that was like, that's not good. <laughs> So uh, hopefully we can get this situated today. They just ordered some new new valves and handles from Boydston. They ordered a complete new set. So we're gonna find out and see what happens. Well, I was gonna try to do a fun 10 car load for you guys with tracks. We were gonna stack it a certain way that I've never tried before, but it didn't work out that way. Two cars, only had one key in them. Other one, vehicle not in the bay location. The other one, well, yeah, another, just another vehicle bay not in location. Vehicle not in bay location. All right, looks like we're rolling up to AZ with nine tracks. There you go. Let's go, dude. We just gotta go to Y. Get the ham and cheese croissant. So bomb big. About to get this coffee. Only three people at a time. Thank you. Hi, good morning. Uh, is that ham and cheese? Yeah. Uh, yeah, can I get the ham and cheese croissant? Yes, please. Yeah, this twist. Dude, <laughs> I don't know what that you call it. Cinnamon twist or cinnamon roll? Okay. And then just a large coffee.
ain't tryna be no up doc No, oh, I ain't tryna be no up my daddy left from Palestine to Houston in a coffin Nah, he ain't dead, but mentally we probably lost him I feel like Kendrick Perkins running 5-on-5 five five in Boston Cause I've been running way too long, now I just feel exhausted Cause I've seen 18 weeks at 8 Band-Aids won't fix the wristlets Carved up a 6-6 six, six. I was on a list I grew up a misfit All black lipstick White face paint Tongue out like a kiss disc My partner gave me six bricks And he told me flip this Money bags with a mask on Like Ipkiss If he wanna run I hit the blitz with the hit Stick the biscuit Or turn a grown man To a pancake biscuit You get to acting like a hot shot Now your body bleeding from the hot shot You shouldn't have to be my hot you shouldn't have to be my wife. Now by the time my daddy left, I barely switched the size and diapers He was searching for a source to get him higher Higher learning, I'm focused, barely make good decisions I guess when you missing Papa, you tend to be lacking vision I marvel how we avenge it, split it with the opinions Divided by our position, suspicious of our condition Even though people killing it, lying to get commission Cause you can live with somebody and never know they intentions sure These politicians be selling my people, that science fiction I'm guided by my conviction, they think it's a contradiction I bleed on my composition, my fr- Stunting on me, dude. Putting all the lights on. All right. Oh my God, we just got a bunch of heavy hits. Hey, hey, you son of a bitch! Woo-hoo. Gang, gang. Last, uh, last Benzo for the week over here in Henderson. But we got to go all the way back to Cali because that's where we're uh, hanging out with the family. Hey, Mark, well, why are you, uh, why are you dropping them off over here by the, by the BMW? You know, you're supposed to park over there for Mercedes Henderson. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Trust me, I know. I'd love to. I'd love to park over there. Only this guy. Apparently he's supposed to be delivering that uh, Sprinter van and this, uh, his caddy won't start. Poor fella. Poor fella, you know. Oh well. At least uh, we got our cardio in because we gotta run all the way back to the truck. Not that it was too far or anything, but it's just, uh, I just counted as cardio, even though every day is cardio for me. Wish we were lifting heavy. I wish I was able to lift heavy every day so I can get big and slow. And they call me Lil Swell. But we're not Lil Swell. We're a little cut, a little lean and mean, dude. All right, there's the there's the locksmith guy. Been locked out of the truck for like ever, dude. <laughs> I just came to the damn mall to buy some last minute sort of gifts and stuff. Uh, that's my life though, you know? That is my life. All right, let's go back to Cali, back to back. Do I even have hours left? <laughs> dude, I don't even got hours left, bro. Should I just PC across the scales? What do you guys think, dude? Nothing but a G thing, baby. Oh, this isn't a G63, it's a G550, right? That's the 550. All right, we just had a drop here. We had to make a drop here in uh, Nissan, Henderson Nissan, because there wasn't enough. There wasn't enough Benzos to fill up the truck to get back home. So, we had to go to Wilmington and uh, pick up two Nissans. Nissan Sports, no biggie, too easy. So yeah, we're gonna go there now. Now we're just gonna go down the road, drop off, drop off five to Henderson, Henderson Mercedes, and then go to Las Vegas Mercedes, Fletcher Jones on Sahara. Finish off our week. That's all we did all week. We just dropped off Mercedes all week long. And I think I got more tired from doing that all week than anything else. <laughs> this thing is annoying. They need to, they need to, uh, they need to fix this. It's like gets caught every time and I gotta force it every time I get that situated oh man what the heck did this driver do what'd you do dog oh man. that's it my friends we made it we're dropping off these pole stars over here in uh San Marin, Volvo. Let's 
crazy, man. Pick these things up at pick these things up at five in the morning. It is now 5:03, and we're just dropping them off all the way over here from Oxnard. We had three drops to do. Yeah, so we did three drops. First one was in San Rafael, right next to San Quentin Prison, and then the other drop was in Portadera for mini. So we dropped there, and then this is our this is our last drop. It's actually a pretty easy drop. Now if I can just find a lot porter they like to hide they like to hide from us car haulers they act like they're doing something it's always so busy all right so we found a lot porter right there he's pretty chill that's always good when they're just chill they're not trying to trying to be like oh i'll be with you in like 15 minutes i got a bunch of other nonsense i need to do let's go get this last one off huh look at all these volvos dude People really like bubbles out here. Whoa, look at this pink one, dude. Is that like a Mary Kay? But that's like a Mary Kay type of Land Rover. That's crazy though. I don't know about that. Look at that Land Rover, huh? Oh, needs a rim. Look at that beast right there, huh? International. Woo! That's fire right there. Look at that F type. Dang, what are those? 20s? They look like 20s. No, that's was a tight 19. Oh, look at this Range Rover though, dude. Someone, someone got super excited. Those are crazy right there. I don't know how I feel. I don't know how, how I feel about those. What do you guys feel about those? Write in the comments. Look this guy's about to hit me right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Woo, let's get this, boy. Look at that lift sticker, though, huh? People have been liking that. We got the stunt lights on. Duh. One handed, dude. Getting our workout on. Playa? It's cool, man. This thing, like, senses you, bro. It senses you when you get in. And it's like, that'd be cool if it's like, yo, what up, Mark? What are we, what are we, what are we gonna do today? Yeah, that'd be cool if the car's like, yo, what up, Mark? What's cracking, man? We gonna get into the, we gonna get into it today or what? Oh, that's cool. It gives you like a 360 view of my truck. What, dude? That's so tight. <laughs> uh, I wonder if it like, you know what I mean? Let's see. Oh, dude, it like shows me going over the, oh, that's so tight. But we're just gonna focus on this part right here. This is the most tricky part. So we're just gonna go ahead and focus on this. <laughs> that's pretty dope though. That'd be cool if I had like something to keep looking at it while I'm offloading the car. Anyways, this is, overall it was a pretty good day. We're gonna go ahead to uh, Richmond BMW and load up. I think either some BMWs or I gotta go to Venetia. We'll see what's up, huh? See what's Gucci did? Yes, sir. We just got uh, got to BMW of uh, Pleasanton, California. Let's go ahead and uh, take out this lovely X5. Like a glove. Like a glove. I really like their uh, festive setup over here at Pleasanton BMW. Look at they got the Christmas trees. The red bows on all the cars. Come on now, dude. It's like, you know, isn't that lovely? Doesn't that just melt your heart? We're just gonna drop these cars over here in the service drive because the homie Fernando told me I could do it. So I was like, hey man, I'm not gonna argue. I'm just gonna drop them right here. Because uh, on the notes it says it says to drop them at the at the address that's listed. It says to drop them. On the address listed, uh, and so I go to that. I go to the address, and unfortunately, there wasn't a lockbox that was supposed to be there. I'm like, dang it, did someone ruin this STI again? You know, type of thing. Yeah, so I'm just like concerned that I'm not gonna be able to drop these till tomorrow morning. I'm over here looking for a parking spot to just crash out because I don't know who else to call right now about whether or not this is a, uh, if I'm able to drop this overnight. So luckily the homie Fernando came through. He just told me, line them up in the service drive, bruh. So that's what we're gonna do. Got a few more cars to take off. Then we're gonna go to Benicia and crash out over there. Be ready for some, uh, some more units. Oh shit, there he is, dude, there's Fernando. Yeah, get that car on there, huh? <laughs> Where are you going? Hey, what's up? Good morning, good guys, good guys, good guys, good guys. Sorry, 
I'm over here shivering, bro. <laughs> it's like, uh, I think it's 19 degrees over here in Paso Robles, but uh, what's up? It's cold as hell. Even the dirt got, uh, you know, ice on it and stuff. She's a little bit icy. Anyways, yeah, man, we just got here to Paso Robles. <sighs> Mo -ho Mole, Mola, hey? Mola, hey! In Paso Robles, Dodge, Opar, what's up, dude? Yeah. Anyways. It's cold. Did I mention it was cold? And I just got finished being sick. It's just, put that in park, brake on, power that engine down. Let's grab the keys. We gotta lock all the doors. Is it locked? No. Damn it. I don't know why the Dodge does not let you just lock everything regularly. It's weird. Let's lock that guy. Let's lock that guy. Always remember to get the keys, huh? <laughs> Before you lock all the doors. But this is the only thing that sucks is I don't know how to lock this door, right? You're supposed to lock these doors, but since the car is still in transportation mode, I don't know why the keys, the the keys, they don't work to lock the doors or lock the rear door too. So it's kind of weird. Whatever, dude. Look at that beautiful sunrise. Man, that's beautiful. Isn't it a beautiful day? I think so. Let's put a smile. Oh, I can't even write a smiley face. Well, sort of. Jeez, that's how cold it is. Wow, all right. My body heat. I'm not hot enough to melt the ice on a window. <laughs> Good day, huh? Good day. Look at that. Zoom in action, son. But yeah, man. Yeah, man, we're back, dude. We are gone for two weeks, dude. We were sick. We got the flu. You know, the regular flu that everybody forgot that you could get. So that was fun. Not really. Just got, got my ass kicked for like three days. It was not good. We're good now. We're back and we're rolling, you know? Just glad to be back to work, nice and healthy. Try not to get sick again, but damn, it's cold as shit, dude. We might get an ammonia or something crazy, bro. But we just hope we don't get all that, you know? All right, my friend, this is it. This is the last load of the year. Last load of the year for 2020. We brought this 10 car load up here to Las Vegas. I dropped a, a mini, had the mini at the end right there. Uh, yeah, so we're dropping right here at Las Vegas BMW. Look at this Z4, dude. I'm so glad I got, I, I put this right here underneath because we were able to get this down really low. Look how much space, we got so much space right there. But she is low, dude. I mean, low, 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 low. We're hella low right here for sure. See that? Oh, she low, dude. Z4 Roadster. We got the Competition M2 up there. That's about 85 Gs right there. Customer sold. We got a few M4s. Dude, I, I am not mad at these M4s, honestly. Look at that girl, dude. That girl's sick. I don't know why everybody was like super hating on those. I don't get it. But anyways, let's get this load done. Dude, I love this new camera angle I got going on. It kind of gives you this like fish eye lens view. So this is gonna be, uh, it's gonna come in clutch for better, uh, better shots, you know what I'm saying? So if I go back to regular view, it gives me, it gives me um, less coverage. And then I go back, boom, more coverage. It's clutch. All right, let's get these cars off. We gotta start our new year. New year, new me. <laughs> new year, new me, bro. Let's go. All right, so one of the things about when you're putting this over this car is since this is a real world drive car you want to make sure you leave these straps tight on the front on the front wheels because when when we put this in neutral and we take the brakes off we don't want the car going back right so like i said you want to make sure these 10 these two front steers 
are nice and tight because once once I slide this thing back, these straps are the, gonna be the only thing keeping this car on these. Uh, <coughs> bless me, thank you. I'm gonna be the only thing keeping these things on here. All right, so now that we got the wheels unstrapped, the rear wheels unstrapped, we're gonna get up in this car, <coughs> turn it on, put it in neutral, take off the brakes, and then we're gonna we're gonna slide that bad boy back. Okay. Go ahead and start her up. Release the brake. Put that in neutral. See how it feels when I release the brakes. All right, we're in neutral. Put the windows down. Gonna go ahead and get out of the vehicle. So right now this car is in neutral and the brakes are off. And I should have did this before I got on this side, but we're gonna raise it up, unpin it. So that one's unpinned. So now I'll be able to lower that, that one down. Go ahead and lower this down a little bit. There we go. Now we're gonna go back in the car. Now we're back in the car. We're gonna put her in park. Now she's in park. Brake is on. There's the parking brake. Parking brake is on. All right, now it's on park and the brake's on. Now we're gonna release these uh, the straps on the front steer. Boom, we're good. Let's go ahead and take off these front steer straps. One more. Boom. Oh, look at the gloves match the calipers. What's up, dude? Guys, we got the ultimate driving machine 2020 BMW M2. Total suggested retail price $85,145. It comes with the black sapphire metallic, black Alcantara leather, 19 inch M light alloy gold mixed wheels, M sport brakes with red calipers, mobility kit adaptive and suspension multi-function steering wheel rear view camera m seats m carbon roof m sports brakes with red calibers m carbon roof auto dimming mirrors adjustable seats it has sports package adaptive full led lights ambient lighting apple carplay compatibility m alcantara steering wheel extended shadow line trim m drivers package and of course the harman cardone premium system <laughs>